Today, I am playing Cosmic Call. The developer was very nice and threw everything all at once on the title screen. But yeah, I have a gist of what the controls are. Anyway, let's get into it. Nice fake loading screen. Okay. Oh. Okay, I guess that was shaders loading. Yeah. You should really preload those on the main menu or whatever. So it doesn't happen in game. Hmm? Oh. Oh, look. Yeah, so I kind of like this aesthetic you're going for. Has the Metroid Prime sort of helmet display. I'm sure there's other games that do it too, but yeah, it's pretty neat. Um, maybe it's moving a little too much. The pixel art for the gun is decent, I guess. It's a little bit weird because it's like drawn in perspective but then you can also see the gun like wiggle around and like, like, yeah, it's doing the, that thing is like going up and down and you go up and stuff. So it looks like it's having a stroke <laughs> just a little bit. It's like, this doesn't feel like it's following my cursor, but all right. Hmm. Oh, okay. You can actually hit those things. Okay, and I also have a fist. That's good. Oh, it's a bomb. You know what? Let's just die. Okay, then. Beautiful. Beautiful jibs. Okay, let's just restart. Okay, no, those are just the fauna, I guess. Well, that's kind of neat. We got a little entrance for where we spawned from. Um, so, so far, so good. I mean, it's more or less standard FPS. And FPS are always fun. Okay, I got a new gun. Neat. Uh, where'd my other gun go? Okay, so I guess I can switch to this and then pick up the pistol. There we go. Oh yeah, I really don't like just how much the gun moves. Like, would you move? move your gun like this <laughs> like I'm just walking forward and it's like J -j 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 -j. <laughs> yeah sure it does pack a punch though I think that's the exit portal now let's just go through it Oh, what? <laughs> okay. For a second, I thought that was like a plant, but no, it was just an enemy looking the wrong way. That's kind of funny. Hmm. I do find it kind of weird. Some stuff like this will follow the player, but then other things will just not rotate. It's kind of weird. Like some of the other fauna won't rotate with the player. Oh, yeah, like this thing. I don't know if that's a bug or if it's intended for some reason, but I think it looks a bit weird to have it be so inconsistent. Okay. 
I must wonder, what is the point of this jump? Yeah, I don't really see why you can jump in this game. It's kind of strange. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I was trying to just get the item on the pedestal. Not sure if that's supposed to spawn on top of the portal like that. Oh no, we got a boss. Whatever will we do? Hello? Oh, right. Reload. That wasn't too bad. It's kind of weird how enemies don't face you because then you can like look at them sideways <laughs> and so they're only like a pixel thick and so you could actually miss them like that which can maybe be interesting in a meta sense but it's distracting yeah oh we got a new area pretty neat oh with jumpy physics or is it just gravity? Okay, it's just gravity. Neat. Now I know why the space bar is there. Okay, that's kind of neat. Compared to some of the other enemies, I like how this one falls down and then sticks straight up. Hey, can you shoot these things? Okay, no, they're just another projectile. That's funny. Look. Okay, I like that knockback. That's pretty cool. Got a crevice. And there's nothing. Okay. What? Is it going through him? Okay. Was that a uh, exit? Yeah, it would be nice to have a well map of some sort. When in doubt, run in circles. Okay, right. So this is where I start. I think it was on the right. Okay, yeah, it'd be nice if health didn't waste itself if you were at full, but oh well. Now I know for certain. Man, I can never use these red barrels. Or I suppose they're red eggs, but anyway. Oh, you just walk into them and they explode. That's good to know. Hmm. 
That's interesting. It looks like I started my reload and then switched immediately after. Not sure if that's intended. Yeah, so far it looks like there's only two guns, um, but they're fun guns. Oh, okay. Whoa, what? Okay. I guess I got comboed. And of course, when I need health, it isn't there. Oh, there we are. Come to me, O oh chalice. There we go. Not too bad. Oh. There we are. Now we are relatively safe. Was a level. Let's get the heck out of Dodge. Oh, these enemies are new. Okay, so we got increased difficulty for being in here. That's neat. So yeah, I, I can kind of see how this game will go. So you're going to have multiple areas with different physics and um, properties. You get new weapons, and the enemies get harder or at least more varied. So yeah, I can definitely see this being pretty fun. Yeah, we'll just keep on going until I die. Alright, we got a new gun. The triplet. Okay, we got another rocket launcher. I mean, even though that's neat, it's kind of not what we need. You know? We need something a little bit more medium short range, just in case you, um, or like when you're hitting flying enemies, because they're more likely to be dodged with the lob. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. For a second, I thought this was the red portal. Okay, that's a little bit annoying. I felt like I shot past him and hit the bomb, but I didn't. Yeah, this gun feels a bit OP, maybe? Well, and maybe he's just a weak um, boss encounter because that only took a couple of shots. Hmm. Oh no, that was a greater. I think I got healed 10 or something.
Oh wait, you can go with Kimbo? That's kind of fun. Oh. Why can't I shoot? Huh? Uh-oh, I think it broke. Can't press one or two. I have nothing equipped. E. Well, this is how we die. Trying to equip two wrist breakers and then we break our wrists. <laughs> we can no longer fight. I ain't that too bad. Okay, let's just jump out of here and see what happens. So first pick up our goodies. Ching, 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 ching. And then we'll jump through the portal. Whoop. Okay, we still can't fire. We have no guns. We're armless. Hey, is it too late to become a pacifist? Do you guys want to hang out? Maybe have a cake? Okay, <laughs> so that's the end of this demo, it looks like. Yeah, so I can see this being pretty fun, especially when you add more stuff and modifiers. And, well, maybe not modifiers. I don't know if you're doing that or not, but yeah, so weapon drops, enemy types, room design, all that good stuff. This game should be fun. The main gripe I have is the stylistic choice of displaying things like it's kind of weird how enemies sometimes always face you, it feels like, and sometimes just kind of turn away, and they're like one pixel wide. It's just kind of strange and inconsistent. Now, if you wanted to make that a mechanic, that could be a little bit funny. Like, if the player was also a 2D sprite, they could turn sideways <laughs> and to dodge bullets more effectively. That'd be funny, but probably not what you intend. Wait, has double jump always been there? Or no, it's a wall jump. Um, wait, I think that's broken. No? Okay, I guess it is a wall jump. I just didn't expect there to be one. And then also the guns, the way they wiggle around is like too silly for my taste, but eventually you kind of get used to it. It's like, oh yeah, it's whatever. It would be preferable if the UI like the heads up display you have would actually be the UI. First of all, the guardian text up top would probably make more sense to fit fully on the top bit of the UI. And then you could have like health and ammo types in the bottom left and then your weapons in the bottom right, maybe. I don't know, maybe it's not a good idea to have that stuff move too much. That way, I think Metroid Prime actually put the UI on those moving GUI things. I don't know. It's been a while since I played those. Yeah, I think that's about all I have to say. So let's go out in a blaze of glory. And I'm sure that if you work on this game, you'll go down in a blaze of glory or something.